Stop laughing and set that meme. Set what meme? <laughs> Laugh now, radio. Soon you'll be sobbing like a little girl. So I've got one, two, three, four, five of the six pieces of orb. Alright, one, two, three, almost victory drink. <sighs> okay. Time for the main door. Great hallway. The cradle is ready. Good. You, you're a man. How can you partake in this? Is he all right? He is one of the wicked. Don't pay his lies any attention. I'm not a bad man. It was an accident. He set a man on fire. It wasn't my fault. Why won't anyone listen? That's horrible. Of course. We are dealing with monsters here. I'm not sure I understand the purpose of this room. The arsonist kept crying as he was slowly lowered on and off the impaler. It didn't take much to break him. They, if they, they had meant for him to die, but the torture was working beyond their expectations. It wasn't the method. It was the arsonist. He was different from the others. They could make him forget again. Which part of him are they impaling? Given by the number and positions of the ch chains that just impale whatever they wanted. <laughs> um, it's kind of dark. Uh, getting out. sure I enjoy the way this room is shaking. <laughs> the fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of Landlum. In frustration, he smashed it against the bedpost. Wait, where did this door come from?
Oh no, invisible water monster! Fuck! I recognize him! Let me go talk to Agrippa. I see that all the all pieces you need. I know I have no right to ask anything of you. But if you could find it in your heart to gather the ingredients for wire stopping before attempting to mend the all, there might still be a chance for you to save me. Please, my fate is in your hands. Fuck. <laughs> 